What's going on guys, Ranger here. Welcome back to my channel where we talk about all things tips, tricks, and guides in a gaming and tech space. Today, we're having a look at the option optimizations for Metro Exodus on PC. So when I first loaded this game up, I had a really blurry out of focus image um, and I had to do a bit of tweaking uh, to really get that to a point that it's a nice, sharp, clear, uh, image and so I wanted to share what I did there with you guys today so first thing we want to do is go down into our options menu and down into video now the first thing to note here is turn your motion blur down to low I've got the quality set as ultra and I've got my v-sync on the biggest change for me here was the direct X now I don't have an RTX graphics card I'm running an AMD and so Changing this to DX11 seemed to make a huge difference in the, the way the image is actually displayed. So change that down to DX11 if you have an AMD card. If you have a RTX card, you probably need to have this set as DX12 for the best performance. Hair works I have off. Um, if you're someone that really loves the, the tiny visualizations uh, and the enhancements in that area, turn this on. This will essentially make the monster's hair wave back and forward in the wind and give that extra level of detail, but it will take up a little bit more performance from your GPU. I may even turn that back on at some point as well. I couldn't work out what Advanced Fizz X was, so I actually left that off. It doesn't seem to make any difference at this point. Tessellation I have off just for uh, frames. Uh, texture filtering AF 16 times and shading rate at one times. So that's your uh, graphics optimizations there. That's what has worked best for me guys. Let me know in the comment section below if that is the same settings for you that works well or if maybe you had to choose something else. The other thing that I did want to mention is the controls. So unfortunately in Metro there is very limited ability to customize the sensitivity from the, a different level of sensitivity from the aim down sight or ADS to the hip fire. So there really is only one sensitivity option, which I was a little bit disappointed in. Um, so play around with that, see what works best for you. I've got mine set just over half and that feels pretty good to me. So let me know how you go with those settings, guys. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below, or if you'd like to come and chat to me live, I'm on Twitch at the link below every Wednesday at 7 p.m. and every Sunday at 9 a.m. All times are Australian Eastern Standard Time. And if this video did help you and it was everything that you hoped it would be, please consider subscribing with notifications bell on so that you get notified every time I release more content to help you guys. And with that being said, guys, happy gaming.